um, because I didn't dare to. Here he comes. Right, let's. Let's put him into the shadows over here. And now we are actually at the um, at the audience boxes, I think it's called, um, where the all the privileged people um, are sitting and waiting. And most of them will actually spot you when you go through here. But if you do it quickly, then nothing will happen. Huh? The rats around here perform more than we do. Alright, first box here. I think it's actually empty. But we can have a peek inside the official room. Over there, uh, down there, is one of the doors that I actually peeked through and where people saw me. And that is the main stage um, where I was behind the curtains and playing the harp for the audience. And we can see that there are several people. There are some boxes up above. So, yeah, I should definitely check out... Oh, and a guard. Um, check out the upper the upper floor. Alright, get back outside. And pickpocket her. She has some <coughs> opera glasses. Um, I think most of them have opera glasses, so yeah, all right. And let's get back. Hmm? I thought I saw something. Nope, you didn't. All right, and let's go down here to hear a little dialogue. This latest opera from Valerius and Cribs is a testament to the superiority of human intellect. Man overcomes nature. Oh, my absolute favorite theme. I couldn't disagree with you more. This opera is more of a travesty than a testament. The only thing overcome were my poor ears by that horrendous music Cribs has written. <laughs> You're just miffed because Cribs is fond of tragic endings. That's not it at all. Since Valerius took over, we've had to endure this Mr. Cribs and his twisted little operettas with vines and lycas as villains and other complete nonsense. How can you stand it? Hmm. Well, I say in with the new. That's what I say. <coughs> um, I didn't quite get it what what she said. She was complaining about Cripps and that he was putting someone as villains. And what I understood was vines and lycos. Now, I think I know what a vine is, although I don't quite get what, how someone could <coughs> make them a villain. But what is a lyca? Is it is it an animal or a plant? Because she she said that well they they talked about uh, nature being the evil guys basically and um, man overcoming it. All right, I won't check on these guys because they are standing right in the center of the box, uh, very well lit. And I don't th even think they have something on them, so yeah, I'll just ignore them and instead go into this box. Hmm? I thought I saw something. The rats around here perform more than we do. Yep. <coughs> Another empty box here. Or is there something on the seats? No. <coughs> Upper floor seems to be empty on that side, but never mind. We'll check it anyway. And she has basically, she's exactly an exact copy of the other one, I think. Thank you. <laughs> I just reached around her, uh, her hip, and and got the opera glass. Great. And let's get back. Oh, she didn't even see us. No, she did. Okay, is there another guard here? Hmm. This looks dangerous. And where's the shadow? 
Where's the bloody shadow? Oh, there it is. I actually think that there's a guard here, if I remember correctly. Where does this lead? Is not the right one. Uh, of course, I can't open it with the papyrus. Why am I standing here? I think there's there should be a better spot. Yeah, this is better. Why right, this doesn't work? This doesn't work. This, of course, doesn't work. Um, okay, we can pick it and easily too. No, no, I want to just open it. This is a library! Hooray! Let's close the door. Uh, there are no guards in here, uh, just as well. And. Uh, oh, metal stairs! That is awful! Okay, let's see where this leads. Slowly, careful. Oh boy. Loud, very loud. Wait, uh, again, very dangerous, but yeah, we are up one more floor, and oh, something to read. Uh, let's have a save again. Oh, we can only read one of them. Well, all right. <coughs> oh, this is this is a. Uh, uh, how do you call it? A tail? No. Uh, well, something you perform on a stage in a theater. Uh, I just lost the word. But um, yeah, it's Reginald and Conandra Forest Princess. All right. Again, the natural theme, or the tragical tale of forbidden devotion betwixt our hero Reginald, Hammerhead Novice, and the sportly Conandra Forest Denizen and ruler of all trees. Yeah, subtitles are always very lengthy. Libretto and music by Ian Cripps, the guy. Um, Alright, Act 1, blah 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 blah. You can read through this if you want to. Um, I bet it's very funny. I'll read through it again uh, uh, myself in when I uh, watch these videos again. No, 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 no. <laughs> the forest creatures sing. No, 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 la, 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 etc. All right. <laughs> the people really pay money to see this stuff. Well, we'll take the money from them if they n so desperately need to get rid of it. And um, yeah, let's have a look uh, behind this. Again, going through all this stuff. don't like this position. Oh, this is better. We should be on the uppermost floor. I'll just have a look. Third floor, yes. Um, and we went up the library, so... Yeah, and we've been in Lady Valeria's room already. No idea what this is. Maybe bathrooms. Hmm. An X normally marks like a secret uh, way up or down. So let's see. Was there someone? Great, I can't even... I can't even see... Maybe, maybe there was someone. Uh, yeah, let's head over to... There definitely is someone, and he's coming here. 
can I stand here? No. No, no, no. Oh, gosh. What do I do? What do I do? Oh, God! Which way will he go? This way or over here? Oh, boy. He will actually go in there. Whew! All right. Oh, it's the it's the boxes, the audience boxes. All right. So he is he is the guard that we saw. And is there someone over there? Yeah, but it looks like he's frozen. Hmm. All right. Never mind. Oh. Go this way first. I can't jump this far. Okay, what is what is this? What is over here? Hmm. This looks like all these uh thingies. What's it called again? Like areas and and uh I actually don't know the other words in English because uh yeah, I'm I'm areas, so <laughs> It's the only thing I actually looked up in my English dictionary, so, um, yeah. And I don't really believe in it, so... <coughs> that's why I didn't look up any of the other translations. Oh boy. There's an open area. And... Oh, there's a shadow here. Right, let's see. Oh, come on, Shadow, thank you. Thank you very much. Silliness. Alright, uh, let's wait for him. I hope he comes this way. I hope he won't just uh, use that turn over there again. Come on, over here. Oh, and there's the frozen guy, I think. So he's unfrozen. Great. Phew, alright. him here. This is a nice big shadowy spot. Uh, okay. So... Must have been rats. Whew, thank god that guy didn't see me. Alright, so we can't go there just now because that guy is looking in into our direction. So we will go the other way around, of course. And try to backstab him. I just hope that this guy we just took out was the guy I witnessed earlier. Slowly. Is he now or is he? Okay, apparently he was. This is a good spot here. 